Hey, this is Naveen with your Bad Girls Club recap, and the show last night started off with our vote. Now, Tanisha didn't want JVC to go because she believed that JVC, everyone deserves a second chance, and she was really trying to be nice. And my thoughts were, you know what, I believe in karma, you know, if this old hag screws us over again, you know, it's gonna be, she's gonna do something to screw herself over and it's gonna come back to her, so whatever, I have no regrets. She's gonna get what's coming to her anyways. What they don't show is, before that night, Darlene had been screwed over so many times by Cordelia and Genevieve's ass, and every time she gets drunk or she needs help, who's always there to help her and make sure that she's doing okay because we actually care about her well-being, that's me, Hannah, and Tanisha. We're always looking out for Darlene. Genevieve and Cordelia, never, they never do shit, and they treat her like crap, and that's supposed to be their homegirl? It's like, they have, they have no loyalty as friends. I felt bad for Darlene. She had her men there. They're supposed to go out to eat. And this busted ass, old ass whore, because she probably suffers from Alzheimer's, I don't know what the hell, uh, decides that she's gonna fuck that. Darlene, because Darlene's talking to us, you're gonna hate her, what, she's not allowed to, are we in high school, middle school, she's not allowed to talk to us? The reason we were late to the party was because no one was there to help us set up. It was just me, Hannah, and Tanisha doing all the effing work, and of course Darlene was with her man, and we didn't get mad at her for that, because that's her dude. But we did everything. We didn't get out there till like 7.38. And you know what traffic is like in LA. We did everything. Those skank ass sluts, Cordelia and Genevieve, didn't do shit. So that's why we were late. We had to do everything and we still had to go back and get ready. I'm so tired of talking about Genevieve's busted ass. This stupid bitch, we knew she's trifling. We, uh, we knew that her and Cordelia didn't show up on purpose. And I love how she wants to run her mouth to gym like, oh, I suck her punch, Tanisha. Bitch, you didn't do shit. The cleaning was, it was part of the fucking job. You know what I mean? It's like we had to do it. We signed a 400 page contract, said we're gonna abide by all the stupid rules, including ones of the job, and we did our part. And I love how when we confront Genevieve about shit, this bitch wants to play fucking stupid. Well, guess what? Hannah got you good, bitch. She called your ass out. And you're a dumb asshole. Quit trying to be, act like, oh, I can kick your ass. You can't do shit. You can never do shit. When Hannah cussed Genevieve out, that was my all time favorite Hannah moment ever. I love how Genevieve thinks that, oh, she got us good and she wants to sit there and toast herself at the end of the episode because this bitch sodomized her asshole with a fucking milk jug and urinates everywhere like a stray fucking dog. What, what are you proud of? <sighs> so, uh, I don't even want to talk about Genevieve more. I hate her so much. Anyways, that's it for this week's recap of Bad Girls Club 2. Make sure to stay tuned for next week where we actually meet our new roommate and, uh, Cordelia goes back and forth between what men's she wants.